Hi, and welcome to Unprecedented Journey. I'm your host, Jeff Oppenheim. And if you tuned into our last episode, you had a chance to meet Lynn Janae. She's a nutritionist, she's an author, and she's a restaurateur. She was here to talk to us about diet and nutrition. Not so much from the perspective we're used to hearing, diet, let's lose weight, but on healthy eating, using food for the ultimate health. Makes sense. Now she left us with some of her own resources, linjanae.com, her own website, easy enough to go to. She also has several books, four books so far. First one is The Plan, and the complimentary book with that is The Plan Cookbook. Makes sense. She also has The Metabolism Plan, and of course, what? The Metabolism Cookbook. I see where she's going with this. I'd also like to make a recommendation for another great reference and resource. It's this book right here. It's called Prescription for Nutritional Healing. It's by Phyllis A. Balch. It's an incredible book. It's very helpful to have, great to have, especially if you have family around, because what it does is really enable you to look up everything reverse index, let's say an ailment or a symptom, and how to treat it naturally, just like the title says. So I encourage you to check out that as a resource. I'm also going to leave you with giving Lynn the last word as the expert here, a few extra sound bites that we weren't able to get into last week's episode. So sorry, but I think they're very, very important. I'm Jeff Oppenheim for Unprecedented Journey. Make sure you subscribe, like, comment, share, and I'll see you in the next episode. Until then, stay safe, stay well, and eat well too. When I was a little kid, I was very, very sickly. I had uh, chronic migraines, uh, heart palpitations, all sorts of stuff. And, and that's why I became a vegetarian when I was 14 um, and started you know, studying nutrition and health and became a baker. Um, and I remember reading the books prior to those years. And what inspired me to know was that everything that's on this planet is here to promote our health. So today I was just uh, writing about garlic and garlic can not, uh, not only helps to lower our cholesterol, but it's strongly antiviral. Um, so include a little extra garlic in your meals. Um, oregano, strongly antiviral. Thyme, strongly antiviral, right? Right now we, we want to eat foods that help to fight viruses. Uh, there's been an herb which uh, I find amazing, which is called mullein leaf. And mullein leaf helps to um, uh, fight uh, bronchitis and pneumonia and it's antiviral. Well, let's do that. Uh, there's uh, an herb that I love that I always promote. It's called lemon balm, which is in the mint family. And it helps to fight anxiety and aid a deep sleep. So why not just add that to your food? Right now we're just, you know, touching uh, upon things like turmeric uh, and its anti-inflammatory benefits. And with all of my recipes, I'll always discuss the health benefits. And a very important uh, concept to remember is that your body will always divert energy from healing to digestion. And when you eat the foods that work for your body, your body doesn't spend as much energy digesting and instead goes back to repair.